Last year proved challenging on many fronts, yet gaming left 2022 stronger than ever. We added 20 million new PC gamers to our ranks and 100 million since 2019. Steam peak daily users reached a new high of 32 million, up 16% from 2021. Esports viewing hours increased 40% over the prior year. The 2022 League of Legends Champions Finals broke a new audience record. And no one missed the Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2 release, which exceeded $800 million in the opening weekend. Bigger than the combined openings of Top Gun Maverick and Doctor Strange in the Multiverse of Madness. Last fall, we introduced a quantum leap in PC gaming, our Ada Lovelace architecture. Ada features next-generation shader cores, RT cores, and tensor cores, and breakthroughs in graphics like shader execution reordering. Ada also delivered a stunning advance in neural graphics. AI will change gaming forever. Every RTX GPU comes bundled with a supercomputer, training AI networks to generate high-resolution frames from a lower-resolution base. The AI inference is then done in real time on RTX tensor cores, this is DLSS. With Ada, we introduced the next breakthrough in AI-powered graphics, DLSS 3. DLSS 3 uses AI to generate entirely new frames outside of the graphics pipeline, boosting game performance up to 4x over legacy rendering. For CPU-limited games like Microsoft Flight Simulator, DLSS 3 frame generation doubles the frame rate and the supercomputer is always running as we continue to enhance the network to better understand different classes of game content. Look for our next DLSS 3 update later this quarter. DLSS 3 momentum is in high gear. There are over 250 release games and creative apps that have turned to AI-powered DLSS to boost performance. And DLSS 3 is being adopted by developers faster than any prior NVIDIA tech, with 50 released or soon-to-be-released titles. Let's take a look at DLSS 3 in action in some of today's biggest games. nice, but we already know that. And there is more to come. Witchfire is an upcoming dark fantasy first-person shooter from the Astronauts, a BAFTA-winning studio and the team behind Painkiller and Bulletstorm. I'm excited to announce that Witchfire will feature the AI performance boost of DLSS 3 when it launches in early 2023. Let's take a look at exclusive new gameplay of Witchfire. The Day Before is an open-world MMO survival game set in a deadly post-pandemic America overrun by flesh-hungry infected. It's one of the top most wishlisted games on Steam. Today we are announcing The Day Before will launch March 1st featuring ray tracing and DLSS 3. Here's an exclusive look at The Day Before with RTX on. Oh, that that.
Hey. Looks familiar. Division. Remember? Warhaven is a medieval fantasy sword fighting experience by Nexon. It will pit teams of 16 players against one another in brutal battles with blades, bows, and magic. Today we are announcing that Warhaven will be accelerated by NVIDIA DLSS 3 when it launches later this year. Here is an exclusive new look at Warhaven. Or two thirty, right? Coming soon. Throne and Liberty is a brand new IP from NCSoft. Famous for universally acclaimed MMORPGs, including Guild Wars 2, Lineage 2, and Blade and Soul. Coming in 2023, RTX gamers will jump into boss raids with a performance multiplier of DLSS 3. Here is an exclusive reveal of Throne and Liberty. Great. Atomic Heart is one of the most anticipated games of 2023, where you take part in explosive encounters in a mad and sublime utopian world. Releasing February 21st, RTX gamers will explore this twisted sci-fi world with DLSS 3. Let's take a look at exclusive new gameplay of Atomic Heart. The reflection looks right. It really is. We built GeForce Now to make high-performance gaming accessible to billions of gamers. It is now serving more games to more countries than any other gaming service. Subscribing to GFN puts a GeForce RTX GPU in any client, including Chromebooks, phones, low-end laptops, even MacBooks. 25 million members have enjoyed playing over 1,500 games, including Fortnite, Genshin Impact, Far Cry, and Apex Legends, with more games added each week on GFN Thursday. GeForce Now continues to expand globally through our network of partners that now include Rain Communications in South Africa, 
YTL Communications in Malaysia, and GFN.AM in Armenia. I'm excited to announce that the Ada Lovelace architecture is coming to GeForce Now. The new RTX 4080 SuperPods will deliver an amazing 64 teraflops of graphics goodness to each gamer. That is five times the performance of an Xbox Series X, and will include full ray tracing and DLSS 3. For competitive gamers, we're also bringing NVIDIA Reflex to GFN. The RTX 4080 SuperPods can render and stream at 240 frames per second. When combined with our Reflex technology, it achieves click-to-pixel latency below 40 milliseconds, a first in cloud gaming. That is about half the latency most console gamers see. Take a look for yourself. GeForce Now. The RTX 4080 will be available in our new Ultimate membership, which is replacing our highest tier, the RTX 3080 membership. Only Ultimate members will have exclusive access to our highest performance GPUs and can stream at up to 4K and 240 frames per second. RTX 4080 availability will start in select data centers in late January with added coverage across North America and Western Europe throughout Q1. All RTX 3080 members will receive the ultimate upgrade and be among the first to become ultimate members. And more exciting, the price to existing 3080 members will remain the same, just $19.99 a month. The GeForce RTX 4090 and RTX 4080 launched last fall, delivering our biggest leap ever in performance and power efficiency. The RTX 40 series extended our leadership in graphics, including ray tracing, AI-powered DLSS, and Reflex for low-latency competitive gaming. Today, I am excited to announce our next GPU in the family, the GeForce RTX 4070 Ti. The RTX 4070 Ti delivers up to Ti. three times the performance of our previous flagship GPU, the 3090 Ti. It will max out your 1440p gaming monitor, delivering over 120 frames per second on modern games like a Plague Tale Requiem, Warhammer 40K Darktide, F1 2022, and Spider-Man Miles Morales. With the power of DLSS 3, the 4070 Ti delivers 1.8x performance across a range of titles, while consuming almost half the power. The RTX 4070 Ti is packed with 40 teraflops of Ada shader cores, 93 teraflops of third generation RT cores, and 641 teraflops of fourth generation Tensor cores. It features dual AV1 encoders to double the performance of video export. The RTX 4070 Ti will be available on January 5th with a starting price of $799. The RTX 40 series is the ultimate GPU That's real for bargain. serious gamers and creators. And the RTX 30 series continues to be the best GPU for mainstream gamers, starting at just $329. Gamers and creators are turning to RTX laptops to drive the most demanding games and apps. The need for performance and portability has fueled RTX laptop growth well beyond the overall this PC is market. I'm waiting for the laptops. And now over one third of GeForce users are creating. And there's more to come with 60% of the GeForce laptop installed base not yet upgraded to RTX. Power and thermal constraints are the ultimate challenges in delivering high performance in thin, highly portable laptops. With the Ada architecture, we set out to transform laptops through process, design, and technology. The result is a massive two-third reduction in power at the same performance. Put another way, Ada beats our current flagship GPUs with one-third the power. Today, we are announcing the GeForce RTX 40 series laptops. They are three times more power efficient and bring the Ada architecture DLSS 3 and new Max-Q technologies to the next generation of laptops. Across gaming and creating, RTX 40 series laptops deliver up to four times the performance in the most demanding apps. 
blowing away the previous generation in creative apps like Blender and Arnold, and top AAA games like Cyberpunk 2077. For years, we've worked with system OEMs and CPU manufacturers to look beyond the GPU to a full system design approach to performance and portability. We call it Max-Q. We optimize every aspect of the laptop, the GPU, CPU, memory, thermal, software, display, and more to deliver powerful devices that are thin and quiet with great battery life. And with every generation, we have featured new technologies that take laptops even further. Today, we are introducing four new Max-Q innovations. DLSS 3 has been optimized for laptops, built into all of our Max-Q technologies, mm. including whisper mode and battery boost, improving the performance, noise, and battery life by up to 2x. We've partnered with memory manufacturers to offer the lowest voltage GDR6 ever shipped and tri-speed memory control that enables the GPU to switch to newer, low-power memory states dynamically. Finally, Ada's on-chip memory has been optimized for Max-Q, doubling the bandwidth, increasing the size 16x, and improving clock gating. Our focus on laptop design and Max-Q has led to a massive 22 times increase in efficiency over the past six years. Highly portable, 14-inch laptops are becoming the fastest growing form factor. Over 13 million were sold last year, twice as many as in 2020. Yeah. But 95% of these laptops are only capable of basic productivity tasks. Thanks to the RTX 40 series, 14 inch laptops are transformed and able to take on tasks never before possible, like ultra fast 3D rendering in Blender, or cutting edge AI tools in popular apps like Adobe Photoshop or Premiere Pro. They are also gaming powerhouses, up to twice as fast as a PlayStation 5, but one sixth the size. You can play the latest AAA games like Cyberpunk 2077 with ray tracing and DLSS. Connect them to an external monitor and your 14 inch ultra portable becomes a desktop class gaming rig or creator studio. Today, we are introducing the new RTX 4070, 4060, and 4050 laptops. Faster than our last generation flagship laptops at one third the GPU power, delivering 80 frames per second, 1440p ultra gaming, and transforms creating, like rendering scenes in Blender that used to take two and a half hours to just 10 minutes on RTX. 40 series laptops start at just $999 and will be available on February 22nd. The Ada architecture has also enabled a new class of enthusiast laptops. I'm excited to introduce today the new RTX 4090 and 4080 flagship laptops. They start at $1999 and will be available on February 8th. These are the world's fastest. Gamers can play on up to three 4K monitors for surround gaming at 60 frames per second, enough to power a professional grade driving simulator. Creators can use NVIDIA Omniverse at 4K for 3D design with full simulated physics, lighting, and materials. Live stream your games at 4K 60 frames per second with AV1 to Discord. And Ada's new dual channel encoders cut video export time in half. The RTX 40 series is our biggest launch ever. There are laptops coming from every major OEM. With a huge variety of devices, there is an RTX laptop for every gamer and creator. Now I'd like to introduce Stephanie Johnson, our global marketing VP for studio and cloud gaming. Thanks, Jeff. Gamers demand the absolute okay. best this performance, was for me. but they are not alone in those needs. With over 110...